birthday or and. Um, the other book that is officially out today, although the big celebration won't be until May, is this incredible collection, Taking Root in the Heart, which is um, a celebration of 34 poets who have been published in the Christian century over the past 25 years. And our very good friend Jill Baumgartner is the editor of this collection. I've had the incredible honor over the past few weeks of um, emailing and conversing with several of the poets who are featured. Um, we'll be publishing a series on social media of videos of these poets reading some of the poems from this collection. And I, I can't even tell you, there's something about conversing with these people whose words have already attained such an incredible place of honor. And, and you can still talk with them today. It's just amazing to me. Every time I, I got to talk with Sydney Lee this morning, and it was just such a delightful 15 minutes. I'll never forget it as long as I live. So anyway, um, you're all probably very familiar with Jill's work as a poet, and so many people have been receiving the Christian century for years and years and years. So this is really um, a collection that I would say, obviously, is for poetry lovers, but also is quite a powerful tool for a practice that's growing lately, which is using poetry as a devotional practice. It might not be that you've had personal experiences with exactly what the poet is writing about, but I guarantee if you take just a minute every day, choose one of these poems, spend a few minutes reading it quietly, go back, read it out loud, um, explore some of the images, really pay attention to the words that are chosen, um, you'll, you'll get a lot out of it. Poetry lovers know what I'm talking about, but those of you who maybe aren't as familiar with poetry or haven't always been fans, I really highly recommend it. There's so much variety in this book, and um, Jill has done an incredible job putting it together. Um, just flipping onto the back, and um, our good friend Sarah Arthur wrote a lovely endorsement um, which I think describes the book so well. She says, if there's such a thing as a fine arts gallery for poetry, this is it. Baumgartner is well familiar with her subjects, gifted with extraordinary sensitivity to their uniqueness, but it's her ear for how they speak to and through one another that makes this curation unforgettable. So that's new today. Um, the big celebration in Chicago is May 11th, and we'll really look forward to that. People can sign up to our mailing list and receive an email just on that tomorrow. Great. Thanks, Katie.